That is a massive skill set and an incredibly powerful approach to getting work done. So the other day I was talking with a chef and he asked me like if there was one thing that chefs need to do better than anything else, what would that be? Obviously, I have a lot of opinions on this subject. I've been thinking about this a very long time. But I think the one piece, biggest start, would be to figure out how to make things less complicated, right? To remove the complexity of problems, of the job, of the world that we live in. Our jobs are by nature incredibly complex. The confluence of staff, of food product, marketing, and I don't mean necessarily marketing from like an Instagram perspective, but like marketing from the fact that you have to teach a front of the house staff how to serve a menu, tell them about the menu, teach them how to sell, encourage them to sell, support them with the tools that they need to in order to sell, right? It's a very complex thing. And if you look at it, most every other industry breaks those up into individual little departments. Your operation may even have a marketing department, yet it's still a piece, a function of the role that you have. If you can start to kind of break out that mass of knotted, tangled ends and lay them out individually into individual strands, it becomes that much easier to manage those pieces. And quite honestly, that's a big function of my business. We take really complex problems. We try and undo the ball that is the mess of all of those complexities intertwined together and lay them out so that we can deal with them specifically, separating time, separating the staffing challenges or successes, separating out the food, separating out the creativity. Each one of those individual lanes provides us with an opportunity to take a step-by-step -step to complete a project. When I was a younger cook, there was far less patience with the understanding of the work that needed to get done. And very often I found myself with a, here, go make Kako Van. I've used this reference before, and maybe you've heard me talk about it before, but I think it's a it's amazing example of how complex something can be and how that complexity becomes simpler for us the longer we do the project, the task. At this stage in my career, I understand what it means to make a cock au vin, chicken with wine, right? Now, I understand the garnish, I understand the butchery, I understand the marinating, I understand all of those pieces. But when that was first presented to me 30 years ago, 25 years ago, somewhere in between those two, I needed to learn the butchery. I needed to learn the marinade. I needed to learn the food safety and the sanitation. I needed to learn the organization. I needed to learn the preparation. I needed to learn what a lard don was and from a reputable source. And not only that, but I also needed to do it to the standard of the chef that I was working for, right? So there's some massive complexity there. And as the leader of an operation, I think it's our job to do our absolute best to knock those pieces down into more digestible bites so that way our teams can pick it up. That way we can hand it to somebody who doesn't have 20 years of industry experience and maybe doesn't even want to be in the industry and be able to have them contribute to that final end product. That is a massive skill set and an incredibly powerful approach to getting work done.